What are you going to have for dinner tomorrow? Turkey. They might already be thinking about the turkey dinner tomorrow, but today at Salve Regina Catholic Academy, it's not just about Thanksgiving, but about giving to those who need it. There's some people that really don't have any food to eat, and they really don't have homes, and we have the privilege to be at home eating with our family. We always teach our children that it's always better to give than to receive. As the principal, Mrs. Roxana Elder says, Salve Regina is instilling a generous spirit, even in their youngest students. Today, the whole school celebrates the end of a month-long food drive with a massive Thanksgiving at St. Michael's St. Malachy's Church. All the food collected will go to nearby parishes to be distributed to the needy. We collected food throughout the, the, the month. We collected it every day. We made a big deal of it because it is a big deal to help others. So every day after prayers, the kids would bring something up. And then uh, at the end of the week, our deacon would come and pray over the food so that it would multiply for those that need it. Why do we help others? Because cause some people out there don't have a lot of food and I want, I want to help them take care of what they could eat a lot and they could be proud for the food that they have. Does God like it when we help others? Yes. Yes? What does it, what does it do? Does it make him happy? It makes them happy. But then we're told in a important part of the story. Monsignor Joseph Grimaldi, the man in charge of overseeing Brooklyn parishes, on behalf of the leader of the diocese, Bishop Nicholas Tamarzio, is visiting the school for the first time to celebrate with them. He is happy to see this school teaching a basic principle of the Catholic faith. When we go out of ourselves in, in service and love for others, that in that giving of self, that we truly find our fulfillment and our peace in life. And to teach the children that lesson is the most important lesson I think that we can teach them. To show your love for God by your love for one another. For the students here, giving isn't just during Thanksgiving. They support a different cause every month, like raising money for patients with cancer or baby supplies for expectant mothers in need. In September, we did a coat drive. We spoke about how nice and toasty warm we feel in our coats and to think about those that didn't have that. In uh, October, we did pennies for patients where we collected pennies for cancer patients. God gave to us, so shouldn't we give to others? I brought chicken. How does that make you feel? It makes me feel good because I know that, that that will help somebody in need. The generous students here have one last message for us. Happy Thanksgiving. For Currents from East New York, I'm Katie Breidenbaugh.